Keep your toothbrush away from the bathroom. Inside the bathroom, the toothbrushes are exposed to the humid bathroom air and elements that float in the air of the bathroom, like the spray from a flushed toilet or the mist from an air freshener or cleaning products. You must keep it upright in the container that allows it to air dry. Hey lovelies, welcome to Mind, Soul and Body with Ovi. This is a health education and wellness channel. If this is your first time on my channel, you're welcome to the family. Please join the family by subscribing to my YouTube channel and turning on the notification bell so that you can instantly get notified anytime I upload a new video. To my returning subscribers, I am so happy and grateful to have you here with me. In today's video, I'll be talking about what the dentist wants you to know in order to achieve a strong and healthy teeth. If you are someone that enjoys good food like me and does not want a situation whereby you are told to avoid meat because your teeth are not strong enough, then you have to join my team. Watch this video to the end and put into practice all you have learned from this video so that the next 60 years you will be able to overcome any obstacle that comes your way, if you know what I mean. Without much talk, let's quickly dive into this video. 12 things the dentist badly wants to tell you. Number 1. Brush your teeth two times daily for at least two minutes. You have probably heard this tons of time, but let me tell you how important it is. Brushing your teeth once a day will cause bug and bacteria to accumulate in your mouth, and these can lead to problems like bad breath, gum diseases, and cavities. Cavities are permanently damaged area in the hard surface of your teeth that can develop into tiny openings or holes. Brushing at night is just as important as brushing in the morning because if you don't brush at night, you allow all the bacteria and food particles from the food you have eaten to build up in your mouth and stay there for hours throughout the night till the morning. And when you make this your routine, you are sure on the way to developing tooth and gum problems. Another important thing to note is the time you spend while brushing your teeth. Do not be in a hurry to brush your teeth. Brush your teeth for at least 2 minutes. Watch this video to the end because I'll be showing you how to properly brush your teeth using the different techniques. 2. Do not rinse your teeth after brushing. After brushing your teeth, spit out any excess toothpaste but do not rinse your mouth with water as this will wash away the fluoride from the toothpaste left on your teeth. Fluoride helps to prevent tooth decay by making the tooth more resistant to acid attacks from the plaque bacteria and sugars in the mouth. So by rinsing your teeth after brushing, you are reducing the preventive and protective work that fluoride performs on your teeth. I learned this hack years ago and taught my parents that. They are still happy that they implemented this hack, especially my dad, because he has never had his occasional toothache ever since he started doing this. You might find this weird at first, but with time you will get used to this. If you'd notice that you have a lot of food particles in your mouth, first rinse your mouth with water before you brush. In that way, you won't feel the need to rinse your teeth after brushing because of the particles of food. 3. Use a fluoride toothpaste It is very important to use a toothpaste with the right concentration of fluoride. We have discussed about how fluoride helps to prevent tooth decay and how it protects your teeth from plaque and bacteria in the mouth. Ensure that you and your family are using a fluoride toothpaste with at least 1350 ppm of fluoride. 4. Clean your tongue very well. The tongue is the bedrock for bacteria, so it is very important and beneficial to clean your tongue to avoid the buildup of bacteria and food debris on the tongue. You can clean your tongue with a normal toothbrush, but it is also advisable to invest in a tongue scraper to help remove plug and bacteria from the surface of the tongue. 5. Keep your toothbrush away from the bathroom. Inside the bathroom, the toothbrushes are exposed to the humid bathroom air and elements that float in the air of the bathroom, like the spray from a flushed toilet or the mist from an air freshener or cleaning products. The humid environment of the bathroom 
allows pathogens in the toothbrush to thrive. It is advised that you keep your toothbrushes away from the bathroom. You must keep it upright in a container that allows it to air dry. Six, do not use toothpick. It is so common for people to grab a stick of toothpick after eating, especially when they have food particles or meat stuck in between their teeth. But this is a very wrong practice. The pointy end of toothpicks can puncture your gums or accidentally cut your mouth, leading to infections. Some of the toothpicks are not made well and can break or get lodged in your gums. There are better ways to get rid of food particles in between our teeth and this includes flossing or using interdental toothbrushes, which we are going to discuss in the next point. 7. Floss at least once a day. Flossing is a very important oral hygiene which helps to clean and remove food particles stuck between your teeth. It also helps to reduce the amount of bacteria and plaque in your mouth. There are various types of floss. Some come in trade while others come as a floss pick, which is very popular in this part of the world. You can also use interdental brushes flossing. 8. Change your toothbrush after every 3 months. Ensure that you change your toothbrush after 3 months or once you discover that the brittles are rough because using a toothbrush with rough brittles can potentially harm your gums. 9. Do not use a hard toothbrush. Go for soft toothbrushes so that you don't hurt your gums. Hard toothbrushes can be a bit abrasive and wear down the enamel on your teeth. 10. Wait for 30 minutes before brushing if you have consumed an acidic food. Acidic food, foods and drinks can leave your enamel soft and very vulnerable to injury when you brush immediately. Instead, wait for 30 minutes. This gives your enamel time to harden itself. 11. Limit sugary foods. When you consume sugary foods, the bacteria will break down sugars and create acids, leading to acid buildup on the teeth. After consuming these foods, please ensure that you brush your teeth in order to remove the residue of the bacteria. 12. Stay away from smoking and drinking too much alcohol. One of the effects of smoking is staining on the teeth due to the nicotine and tar in the tobacco. It can make your teeth yellow in a short time. It also results in gum diseases, tooth loss, and in more severe cases, mouth cancer. Brushing your teeth is a very important part of your oral health hygiene. But are you using the proper teeth brushing technique? Pay attention to these details and follow the steps to fight plaque, clean your teeth, and keep your smile healthy. 1. Pack with the outer surfaces of your teeth. 2. Brush your upper teeth and then your lower teeth. 3. Tilt your brush to a 45 angle against the gum line and sweep or roll the brush away from the gum line. 4. Brush the inner parts of your teeth using a back and forth motion. 5. Brush the chewing surfaces of your teeth with a short back and forth stroke. 6. Make sure to brush your tongue. Which of these important oral care tips was your favorite? Please leave your answers in the comment section. Go ahead to watch my other health education videos and my food of the week episodes where I have discussed the health benefits of different amazing types of foods. I'd love to see you again on Mind, Soul and Body with Obi. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss out on any of my videos. Until next time, stay healthy, mind, soul and body.